मुंबई में सीखने के लिए कांग्रेस में सीखना चाहते हैं। यहाँ पर जैसे जमशेदपुर और मुंबई के बीच काफी काटे के टक्कर चल रही थी सुबह में। जमशेदपुर आगे भी निकल गया था। लेकिन क्या करने के लिए मुंबई के परिणाम कुछ और था? परिणाम मुंबई के लिए था। So the game started even between the two sides and then Jamshedpur took the lead. What was your strategy to get back in the game and how do you reckon you did that? I've actually translated that for myself, no problem. But we know coming to Jamshedpur, I said before the game, they're a good team. I'm very surprised where they are in the league because of the football they play and I think the results are not reflective of the performances and we've seen that again tonight. I just said to AD after the game, you know, I think he would stand there and say that they should have at least taken the result, and that's I wouldn't argue with that. Um, but the pleasing thing for us was, you know, when something wasn't working, um, we try, actually tried to make a change before they scored, uh, but unfortunately we couldn't get the players onto the pitch in time. But the pleasing thing was when we did make the change, uh, the impact that those players had. Uh, so to come here, which is a very tough trip away with the travel, um, to play against a very good team. Uh, and to come away with three points again uh, is hugely pleasing. Okay. Uh, Mumbai is a top Considering you're uh, top of the table and uh, the confidence must be high in the, in the team and um, when you play teams which are slightly further down the table, what is the, the thought process the players have? Does it make a difference um, at all and to make a difference today as well? Um, we, we don't approach teams any different regardless of where they sit on the table. Uh, I think this league has shown that any team can beat any team and uh, it's if we needed reminding of that, you know, we certainly had a good reminder of that tonight. And if we don't approach these games in the manner which we need to, which is one of professionalism, one of uh, making sure we do everything that we need to do to, to try and get the result, um, we've shown that teams will make it difficult for us. And that was the pleasing thing tonight. I see this week in training exactly the same approach to this game um, and the preparation into this game than I have in the previous 15. So we don't change our approach based upon the league position um, because we know each team can cause us a problem. All the best for me. Thank you. Coach, uh, we have seen that, uh, you know, Penedo, uh, Mumbai, uh, and the Chamber in the face, also in uh, the home match, it was a very tough and crazy match. Um, you know, it was a very end-to-end -end game. So what do you think, you know, is this something kind of, you know, uh, something is happening in your week that you were facing so many I think at the start of the season we played them in game three. Game three, I think teams were still finding their feet and trying to find out what their best team was and players were getting used to playing together. That was certainly the case for us. Um, and of course, since then, we've had 13 more games. <laughs> uh, so when we play teams, you know, teams have seen a lot more of us in the last couple of weeks than they would have before. So teams come up with different ways to play against us. Um, some, some we've been able to deal with and deal with within first half, and others we've had to take the second half to get, like we have tonight, the result. So I think uh, when you come up against a very well organized team, who are very well coached, um, it's, teams cause you different problems. The pleasing thing for me tonight was that we found a different way and found ways to, uh, to come away with not just the result, um, but obviously the performance, especially the last 20 minutes. Yeah, it's a it's a huge it's a huge result, but um, I think it's more the manner in which we were able to achieve the result. You know, we we keep speaking about we've got a way of playing. Sometimes you don't have uh, it doesn't go the way that you want. You know, for whatever reason, whether you you don't play as well as you can or should. Um, oppositions do something that, that stop you doing that more often than not. But the pleasing thing was, you know, to go a goal down here um, and to be able to come back and, and not just come back and get the equaliser, but the reaction to the players at the equaliser wasn't to settle for the draw. 
the players actually pick the ball up and run it back and put it on the halfway line because they weren't happy and satisfied with the, with the draw, despite how hard of a place it is to come. So that attitude and that mentality to then go on and win the game. 16 games in with four to go is going to be is important and it's going to be so important in the next four if we want to be successful both in the regular league season and now in the playoffs. And just going to pick up this first goal of the United States season. Vikram is a wonderful young player, a wonderful young man um, who has already showcased what he's capable of doing at this level. Uh, we've tried to give him as many minutes as we can so far this season. Unfortunately for him, he's been behind Chante and, and Bipin, who are, are very much in form and leading, leading sort of goal scorers within the, the league. So he's had to be a little bit more patient. But every time he's come onto the field, he's had an impact. He's won two penalties for us. Um, he's actually had a real good shot saved in the previous game. And then tonight to come on and score a winner. It just shows whether it's Vikram, it's Gurkara, it's Ayush last week. We've had young Azif come on. We had Harlan on the bench tonight. The, the young players, if they work hard enough, they'll get opportunities. And I still class him as a young player, but he's already shown what he can do. Now, if he can continue doing that and keep working, uh, he's got a very bright future with us uh, and ahead of himself. Thank you very much.